Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I have a new ballad song for you guys to check out. Um, this is one that was sent my way through um, an authorized dealer. Um, this is the LDY Cygnus. Uh, now, LDY does not have an official website. You actually have to DM, um, I think it's DM two people on Instagram that run the LDY. Um, and then there's a couple people who are sponsored by LDY. I personally got this one from um, a guy named Death Flips, Deaths underscore Flips. Um, so shout out to him. But this is a brand new one um, from LDY. And I got to tell you guys, I am absolutely blown away by this. I have seen a ton of, a uh, handful of reviews of these, and everything has been basically pop, like as good as it could get. Um, so here's the bow song. This is what it comes in. It kind of, it's this cool case. Kind of looks like a, like a Beats case or something. Uh, but we'll get into the bow song in a second. But so you get a trainer blade, which is very nice. And then you also get some of this stuff over here. So this is a extra set of hardware. It comes with literally everything, um, which is awesome to see. This is um, one of those, I forget what they call it, NFT tags or something like that. You put it up to your phone and basically, it's like a COA card that has like all the, the specs of the knife on it, which is really cool, kind of like, you know, just something original. And then you've got these very awesome LDY band-aids, which I'll probably end up needing. And then you've got this really nice cloth as well. And a couple of these um, little snacks. <laughs> um, but this cleaning cloth is it's thick and it's huge too, which I really appreciate. Some of these smaller ones that you get with like Civivis and stuff are, they're nice, but like, they're kind of like your classic standard, like sunglasses cloth. Whereas something like this is, it's a thicker material. And I really like the size too. Um, so anyway, this is what it comes with. And I really appreciate that. This was brand new. Um, this was a 400, 450, 460 dollar ballast song. Um, totally worth it in my opinion. I think with the unboxing and the quality that you're getting for that, I think that it's a fair price. I really do. Um, so let's talk about the, the ballast song a little bit. So this is a S35 VN blade. This is titanium, um, liners we'll call them with g10 scales and you can see the g10 is actually inlaid into the titanium so they mill out this titanium here and then they lay the g10 inside which gives it a very unique feel um, i've seen a lot of other reviews compare it to the replicant and their comparison is because these are G10 scales as well. But as you can see, they are just slabs of G10. And honestly, these two could not flip more different in my opinion. This is a heavy balisong. This is light. It's got great grip because of that G10, but it is so light and it's very floaty, very bouncy. I have, I have only had this I've only flipped this for a couple hours, and let me tell you, I'm already in love with it. It's basically everything I love about this and everything I love about the Crack Racken combined, but we'll get into that. Let's let's continue um, with the specs and everything. What's nice about this card is when you do put it up to your phone, it gives you all the specs. Like It even gives you like the bushing diameter, um, the pivot diameter, like every diameter and every size of every little screw that's in this which is 
really cool to see. I like when it's when they're transparent like that. They want to give you as much information as possible. Um, and that's just nice. You know, you're spending this much money on a knife, on a ballast song, and that, that's what you want to see. Um, so the construction of this thing is, is really what impressed me right off the bat. I love the look of this blade. Um, but it's these handles that I really love. And the grip is just, it's insane. Like, personally, there there's always been like this, you know, it, it always feels like these um, channel ballast songs are like the more premium option, you know, where it's one piece of titanium and then they just mill it out. But honestly, the sandwich construction just offers so much more grip, being that both sides are open. So you have grip on both sides. They have these nice cutouts here. And then the whole thing is basically covered in G10. So, I mean, it's basically the best of both worlds, in my opinion. Um... Like I said, this thing feels great. Carries momentum well. Aerials are easy to time. Chaplains feel great too. Like right here, they have the exposed titanium. And it really does. Like you can tell that, that everything on this battle song was designed for a purpose. And I really enjoy that. Um, kind of the comparison I was making earlier. While flipping this, it reminds me... Of the crack racket and I say that for a couple of reasons so as you can see they are basically identical in size um, I think the crack racket is a bit heavier and when you're flipping you can definitely tell um, this is a bit more neutral in my opinion but this g10 makes it just bounce and float something that you know you achieve with the um with the crack racket but not something you achieve with the replicant in my opinion um now as you can see the replicant is a little bit shorter than these two um and it is definitely heavier um and this is nice for carrying momentum but it can make um some tricks a little annoying um one thing i'll note on this is i really the g10 is nice but for things like chaplains and stuff it can start to eat away at your fingers just a little bit i have rough skin so i don't really notice it as much but if i'm doing like a solid hour of flipping i will notice it with the crack rack and that is not the, the case however the grip on this is nowhere near these two and you know with the the version 2.5 they have this cut right here but at the end of the day this is aluminum and it's slippery even with um something like my medusa here you know they've got these really nice cutouts and this jimping and everything but at the end of the day you've got this big slab of titanium and you know it gets slippery it gets slippy especially when you're doing tricks when you're you know learning tricks or trying something that you're not exactly comfortable with it slips and what's nice about this g10 is it helps to negate that and i really appreciate that so in my opinion it flipping it reminds me of a crack racket but without the problems of the crack racket it has everything that i like about the replicant um but just in a lighter package and in a more refined package in my opinion i like longer balisongs and you put it up against something like a serif, which the serif is my favorite. And you can see serif is a little bit longer, but not by much. Um, the blade has a little bit more on it, but the handles are pretty close. And, um, and this does feel lighter when flipping. I'm not sure the exact, uh, the exact specs on these, but it feels lighter and it just it feels very refined and i really like that about this um so yeah there's kind of my little overview slash review of the ldy cygnus i'm gonna keep flipping this thing maybe i'll do a bit more of a review down the road 
Um, but as it stands right now, this just went to the tippy top of my list as my favorite flipper um, right there with the Serif. And, you know, again, the Serif is $200 more. So, um, so just keep that in mind. But yeah, LDY, they do drops through Instagram right now. Um, you can check out deaths underscore flips. He might have um, some in stock. I'm not sure. But just look up LDY Ballas on one Instagram, and that's your best bet as of right now. So thank you guys for stopping by. I wanted to throw in, you know, a little Ballas song here and there. I just uh, jumped in on the, they're doing a pre-order on their other Ballas song, the Cirrus V3, which is an aluminum Ballas song, like the Crack Racken. Um, so that's probably not going to be here for a few months, but I uh, really like what LDY is doing. And I want to shout them out. So thank you guys for stopping by. And I will see you in the next one. Cheers.